Okay, so I just wanted to take some beautiful pictures of our school. So right behind me here is the commons. This is where we spend all of Photo our time. Lori. Jane, I'm working. <laughs> Who are you talking Why to? would you do it? Who's this for? I, I just, doing? there's so many kids that haven't seen this school. I thought it'd be really awesome to do just this really quick tour of the building. What do you think? You good? know why we can get this close together? Because we're wearing our masks. Uh-huh. And we're pretty good friends. We spend a lot of time together. Don't you? You want to go on a tour with me? Yes, 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 yes. All yes. right, right, right. Let's we're do it. Turn it oh, we're going to turn it this way. All right. Okay. So, like I said, this is the commons, you guys. Everything fun happens in this commons. Uh, dances, mm. breakfast, lunch, morning cartoons sometimes. Uh, what, can you think and of anything else, Jane? And a big screen comes down from the side. Oh, yeah, a big screen comes down. On the top. Yeah. Oh, another fun feature is that I like, Lori. What's I that? I six feet away from you. So, oh, uh, right, Mr. right, Dyer right. said I can take off my mask during that part. Okay. Um, that, <clears throat> the, the garage door goes up. Oh, right. Broken, and you can eat out in the courtyard. Yes, <laughs> yes. You can eat in the courtyard as long as we keep it clean. As long as we keep it clean. So, you know what, Jane? Every school looks the same. They all have classrooms. They all have cafeterias. So let's go to the, some of the places that make Ike different and off the charts awesome. Okay, I can think of a couple okay. right off. All right, so where right do you want to go first? Where do you want to go first? The theater. I conduct family meetings in here with all the different classes. Um, gosh, we have we have all kinds of stuff that happens in this theater. Isn't it just gorgeous? All right, where do you think the kids would want to see next? How about the gym? This is the 100 hall. This is performing arts. So the band room is down there. Then we have the choir room, the theater, mm -hmm. and um, physical education. Yes. So this is a 100 hallway. All right. Now we're kind of getting into the gym. You know, it's not just for gym teachers anymore. Um, the gym is where we, I'm, I also, besides doing freshmen, I also do uh, all the leadership ASB. So I'm gonna just look at this ginormous gym. Ginormous gym. It's actually three gyms in one. This is a gym here. Then we got center court. And then on the other side of those bleachers is another is another gym. We have, oh man, we have almost an assembly every month. We get loud, we get rowdy. Um, it's, it's, this, is, this is the room that never sleeps. Wouldn't you agree, Jane? I agree. Our maintenance crew works hard to keep it clean. And you yes. guys are really good about keeping it clean also. Well, you know what helps us keep it clean, Jane? What's that? Come here, let's talk about this together. <laughs> okay. You know, helps us keep it clean. Um, our motto, mm -hmm. integrity, kindness, and engagement. True. You know, people that are that have integrity don't leave a mess behind. People that are kind don't create extra work for other people. Right. And that's also engagement, is cleaning up after yourself and taking care of your surroundings. So after seven years, it's actually pretty incredible how clean this school is and how like new it still is because of students like you. So maybe you don't like contact sports. Maybe you don't like to work in a team. Maybe you like to exercise by yourself. Worry not, we have the facility for you. <laughs> this is another area, but boy, you know what? Ooh, those you stairs. Know what? Boy, we're just getting too old. <laughs> we're out of shape. You oh my gosh. Don't worry about what? this area. I think we're showing you guys. Not the same because you guys are not here. No. We miss you. Oh my gosh, this place is usually just full of of uh, students that are training for their sports, kids that just want to get in shape, even teachers. We, you know, if, if walking up the stairs doesn't win us enough, we can come up here and do the same thing. We'll just do a quick quick look into the um, into the weight room real quick. It's like a damn athletic club, isn't it, Jane? Two teachers right there. You'll meet them. You know who else works down this hall, Jane? Mr. Johnson. Mr. Johnson. Hi. hi. Say hi to the new crew. Hi there. Tell them what you do. We were just bragging on you. Oh, well, this is the funnest class here, aside from uh, maybe drama and leadership. But it, this is uh, one of the funner classes. And we do, we take the cameras out. We take pictures around Eisenhower. I let you take them home and, and use them that way as well. And we have a nice full studio here that you guys can um, get in here and get some experience with lighting. 
and we have uh, leadership opportunities through Skills USA, which is something we compete in. We're, we're the reigning uh, national champion since there was no competition last year, so we're still the You're reigning still champion. You're still it. <laughs> Two years in a <laughs> row. Two years in a row. That's awesome. So, awesome. Great. So yeah. All right. Come sign up for photography. Thank All you, right. sir. All right. Let's go around to the um, science hall down. Down the science hall. Yes. Okay. So the 600 hall has all the science and um, a little bit of foreign language. We do American Sign Language here. Who do you want to pop in on? I am Mrs. Barry, and right now I'm teaching chemistry, period five. This is general chemistry. I am environmental club advisor, so you may want to take this thing as well. Thank you, ma'am. Yeah. Let's see if Mr. McGregor is here. Oh, he is! Hi. I'm Mr. McGregor. I teach biology and chemistry. This door is always <laughs> open, and it's all about kids. And it's way more fun when you guys are here. All right. All right. All right. Thank you, Mr. McGregor. Yep. See you guys. All right. They all have the same brain. They just like, trained they their brain to do did. science. They we didn't train our brain to do science. <laughs> Hi! Hi. We are taking students on a tour of oh, yeah. Eisenhower yeah. High. See this little, this little guy right here? Yeah. What class, what grades are these? A little bit of everybody, probably main, mainly ninth else. graders. Oh, there you go. No, you can't have it. It's what's, his, what's his name? <laughs> Hippo. They call me Mr. I teach honors biology and anatomy physiology. Looking forward to having you all back in the building so I can scream at you in person. <laughs> Something to look forward to. What okay. about, are you a student? Who is that? <laughs> I, I might be small in stature, might be fun size, but my name is Ms. Guerrero. I teach honors chemistry and AP chemistry, so I look forward to having you guys awesome. all in my class as well. Awesome. Welcome, miss you guys, yeah. miss you. I'm gonna take you to the most beautiful, now that I'm by myself, I can do this. <sighs> It doesn't matter if it's night, it doesn't matter if it's day, it doesn't matter if it's winter, it doesn't matter if it's spring. This is the, the most gorgeous view and it kind of helps you get a layout of what the school looks like or how the school's um, laid out on the inside. Directly straight forward is um, where we start the commons when you walk into the school. And you can, so now you can see how the school is shaped like the letter U. Along the brick, you have the 300 and the 400 hallway, and along the blue wall, you have the 500 and the 600. The architects designed it to resemble the Yakima River Canyon. Oh, so right. the blue wall is the river. Right. It's pretty natural habitat. Mm hmm And then the hills are the bricks. Oh, the canyon brick walls. Yeah. That's so cool. Because yeah. you know, Yakima wouldn't exist without the water. And uh, I love that. Yeah. I love that. I think what we're gonna do now, okay, don't come within six feet of me. I don't have my mask on. I think what we're gonna do now, Jane, is go to the library. Wanna go okay. to the library? Okay, we're gonna go to the library. Oh, I know what we could do. Yeah, yeah, Let's yeah. show them how you can cut across the middle of the sky bridge. Oh, okay. That's hey, that's what we'll do, the sky bridge. So people think, do we really only have five minutes to get around? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. That's plenty of time to get around. We actually have a sky bridge that will go um, connect both sides. You can also walk through the courtyard most of the time. Funny fact, when they What's first built fact? the school, when we first got in here, mm -hmm. they forgot all the water fountains. <laughs> There's only one water fountain. In the whole building? In the whole building. Okay. My, that might be on Jeopardy one day. Hello, my name is Mrs. Kessler. I work here in the library. And we cannot wait till you are here uh, to check out our books and use our computers and come see us and do homework and get work help from tutors. So hope you're well. Hope to see you soon. Take care. Awesome. And this is the, the library is beautiful. It's surrounded by windows. Again, beautiful in the summer, beautiful in the winter, beautiful any time of day. Oh my goodness. This yeah. is a long walk. <laughs> 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 ah, golly. Now I know you might say, oh my goodness, this welding. place is so welding. This place is so drab. But you know, we haven't been here since March. So what's really interesting is that everything 
from March is still up. Everything from so March is still like up. Dances. Yeah. But so this is our food science lab. You can you can see there's a ton of kitchens in here, fully stocked yeah, kitchens. And this Hi, is. Hi, Walker here. Yep, she's an awesome cook and her fun, her, it's, it's homework you can eat. Not everybody gets to and say learn that. And science too. And learn science too, and math. Yeah, yeah. There's a lot of math in this class too. So, how about if we make one more stop? You know what, we, where we need to go? Hmm. The office. Yes, that's what I was thinking. Oh, here's one of our favorite people that we need to introduce. Hi, I'm Doug. I'm the custodian here at Eisenhower High School. He's the yes. custodian that everybody absolutely adores. I mean, yes. we adore all of them. And we always like to remind our students that Doug's primary job is to maintain our school, not to clean up after the kids, because those are skills you came here with that you learned from home. So don't make a mess, he has to clean up. Clean Thank you, Doug. Uh -huh. These are our uh, fabulous secretaries. So if you Can you see late, her back there? <laughs> you're gonna come here and you're gonna leave a note. Okay and the attendance specialist okay. will take care of that. If you were to come right in the main door, you're gonna come through this main door, you're gonna buzz. The secretaries really like it when you buzz it. <laughs> Makes them smile. Okay, now we hope that if ever you have to come to this, ac this uh, administrative hallway, it's to get an award or a pat on the back and not to get in trouble. But we have five principals here. One. That's, wait, 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 that's Mr. Stevens. That's Mr. Stevens. And he's athletic principal. Okay. And here's the elusive Mr. Diner. Hi, guys. Welcome to Eisenhower. I know open house is a little different this year. How are you doing, Miss Benoit and Miss Peterson? Good, we're Good. tired. <laughs> I know, walking around the whole entire campus. Uh -huh. Yeah. yeah I, I know our seniors, juniors, and sophomores have been here, but freshmen, oh boy, it is large, but... A uh, lot of fun, a lot of fun goes on here. We are a family and you got two of the best staff members here uh, taking you on this tour. So All of them. Yeah we're, yeah, we're excited to have you guys and can't wait until uh, we can actually have you here. Yeah, so, well so they'll know where they're going once they get here, yes. we hope, if we haven't confused them too much. You haven't, mm -hmm. and I did hear, this is the good office. You come here, we talk about scholarships and all that, so. We're excited to, um, when you come in, and uh, we're excited to have you. So this go. is not a scary place. No, his, no. your door's always open, Diner. Always well, has been. Go cadets. All right, thank you, Mr. Diner. Bye. All right, well, we have nurse right there, kind of probably the uh, the busiest woman in the building anymore. Uh, so a lot of our, because we're working remotely. Ruby, Ruby, is this, is this, yeah. this, this, I'm sorry, go ahead. No, just say a lot of our a lot of our staff is working from home. Okay, okay except for Janae Bourgeois. I think you know this lady. Janae Bourgeois. How's it going? We're doing the open house video. We want the kids to kind of know what they're walking into whenever they get to walk into it. So walk soon because I yeah. miss you guys. Hi, I'm Janae Bourgeois. I'm one of the assistant principals here at Eisenhower. I spent the last three years at Wilson as an assistant principal, and I'm super stoked to be here. Awesome, and we're super stoked to have you. <laughs> yeah. We we all feel a little like our hands are tied right now on how we can, you know, uh, you know what we can do around here. And so until we, we get, we can't do a lot without that. No, to, no, as soon as we get true. bodies here, there's not gonna be any. There's no holding us back. So all right. This, yeah, this is where all the principals are. All know, right. This is where we all hang out. Now this is where all the counselors are. Yeah. So if you're freshmen now, and you'll have a lot of questions, freshmen. When you're a senior, you'll come in here, you'll have a lot of questions about graduating. Um, so yeah, this is used a lot. Yes, yes, it's a great place to hang and feel safe. It is what it is, guys. We're doing our best without you, but this is not how we were groomed to teach. No. This is not what makes our hearts go ping. Our hearts go ping by having your, your, your bodies in here, your minds, your spirit, your youth, your enthusiasm. And I know we did the best I could on the, with this tour going virtual, but there's nothing like it in real person. No, no. There's nothing like it. It will become your home and it will, it will be embedded in your memories forever. You know how important high school is? My father-in-law, my father-in-law was 89 years old. He was still having coffee with his high school buddies. Still having coffee with his high school buddies. That's what high school is about. That and the academics and the social skills and the the community building and it's the incredible. fun and the fun it's fun so 
So just hang in there, guys. We'll get back to we'll get back to the building soon enough. But uh, make sure and look us up, Benoit and Peterson. Okay, so you guys, thank you for joining us, and um, I'm gonna hand it over to the leadership. Do you know teacher? what I really hope? With it. I really hope I hit the start button. <laughs> Hello everyone, my name's Mary Prentice and I am Senior Class President at Eisenhower. I am going to talk about Advanced Placement, otherwise known as AP. AP has as many as 38 available courses in seven different subject areas, and those subject areas include AP Capstone, Arts, English, History and Social Sciences, Math and Computer Science, Sciences, and World Languages and Cultures. Here at Eisenhower, we have a vast amount of AP classes that you can choose to take. And just recently, AP Music Theory and AP Computer Science was added to our wonderful program. As an AP student myself, I have really enjoyed the flexible do-it-yourself approach AP really values. I love that AP allows students to focus on advanced classes in subjects where they excel and that they care about. Did you know that AP tests are cheaper? Um, but here at Eisenhower, we don't let money hold anyone back, and all students taking AP who choose to take the test are paid for. And yes, you heard me right. Not only do you get a free test, and you get to choose which AP classes you take, you have a choice to take the AP exam. If you like challenging classes and just want to take an AP class, but don't want to take the test, you are not at all required to take it. But hey, why wouldn't you? Because if you pass, you get college credit, and who doesn't want that? Speaking of college credit, AP students are more likely to earn one-to-one -one credit at public institutions or mid-tier private colleges, and to earn placement for acceleration at a highly selective college. And listen to this statistic. 85% of selective colleges and universities report that a student's AP experience favorably impacts admission decisions. And compared to IB, AP is more widely recognized by colleges. I love Eisenhower, and I really enjoy taking advantage of as many AP classes offered as I can, and I hope you will too. Have a good day. Bye. Hi, I'm Taylor Yaki, Junior Class Secretary, and today we're going to be talking about leadership. Hi, I'm Kieran Baller, your Junior Vice President. And just because school's online this year doesn't mean that leadership isn't working behind the scenes to make this as normal a year as possible. I'm Haley and I'm the junior class treasurer. The leadership class consists of ASB, freshman, sophomore, junior, and senior class officers. Each group has a president, vice president, treasurer, and secretary. Hi, my name is Jordan Chavez and I'm the junior class president. Leadership runs the dances, fundraisers, and assemblies. Now hopefully we get to experience all these things this coming year. If you're a freshman interested in joining leadership, please contact Ms. Benoit to see when application forms are ready for you. And don't forget, if you have any questions regarding leadership in any way, feel free to email Miss Benoit. And if you have any questions about your schedules, email your counselors. And so, on that note, I hope everyone's staying safe and healthy out there. Hi, I'm Alexa Grunewald, your senior class secretary, and I'm gonna be talking about Renaissance. I took the Renaissance class my freshman year and I had an amazing experience with it. I met a lot of really nice people, I learned how to work with people, and I learned a lot of great leadership skills that I still use. One of the main things that we do in the Renaissance class is celebrate other students and the staff for doing amazing things in the school. One of the great ways that we do this is through the Renaissance store in the Commons. This is just an example, but teachers can hand out Renaissance dollars to students that they see doing amazing things. And these students can take these Renaissance dollars and get themselves a treat during lunch in the commons. It's a sophomore class telling you about the 40 clubs and activities I have to offer. One of the clubs being is the fashion club where you design your own clothes and present it in a runway show later. Another club is anime club where you sit with your friends and watch anime. Other options are the Gay Street Alliance, Drama Club, Environmentalist Club, and the Color Guard. If you haven't heard a club that you like, continue watching for a detailed walkthrough on how to access the website listing all of the other options. In the YSD7 homepage, click Menu, Schools, and All School Listings. Scroll down until you see Eisenhower High School. 
And now at the top, click Menu, Activities and Athletics, and now you're presented with all the clubs and activities Eisenhower has to offer. Hi guys, the sophomore team is going to be explaining what sports they're starting with. Season 2 is December 28th through February 22nd and the sports are boys and girls basketball, girls bowling, boys women dive, and wrestling. Season 3 is March 1st through April 26th. There's going to be football, volleyball, girls soccer, cross country, girls swim and dive, and fast pitch. Season 4 from May 3rd to June 21st, tennis, fast pitch, track and field, baseball, golf, boys soccer, and dance. If you have any questions, you can email Mr. Stevens or the coach for your sport. Hi, I'm Alexa, your senior class secretary, and I'm going to be talking about credits. So Eisenhower goes based on a core 24 system where you need 24 credits to graduate. So you take six classes every semester and you earn half a credit for each of the classes that you pass. So by the end of your four years in high school, you should have 24 credits. This means that you don't have any room to fail any classes. As there is ways to make up credits, it would be easier for yourself just to try to pass all of your classes so that you can graduate on time. Hey cadets, it's Robert, your ASB president. I know first semester is a little bit different this year, but as long as you go to your classes and get your work done, you'll be so, so good. Hopefully, second semester, we can go all out with assemblies, spirit weeks, and especially home games. So, let's get it. Hi, I'm Kieran Bowler, and I'm your junior vice president. Hello, my name is Elizabeth Lorizano, sophomore class president. Today, I want to remind you, change is inevitable. It's a natural process in this world. Just try to welcome it with an open heart and open mind. Ciao. Hi, cadets. I'm Alexa Grunewald, your senior class secretary. Hey cadets, I'm Miranda Wilhelm and I'm your senior vice president. Hey cadets, it's Angela McGregor and I'm your senior class treasurer this year. And I just wanted to say that I'm so excited for this year and I can't wait to see you all in person. So be sure to wear your masks so we can get back to school in person. Have an amazing year cadets. Hey cadets, it's Olivia Rankin. I'm your sophomore class vice president and I am really excited to see you all once we get back to school.